you love cookies. Yes! Look at my new gaming rig. It's all set up. It looks amazing. I can make YouTube videos so amazing with this. Wow. That's nice, Molly. <sighs> but now it's time to go to bed so we can get up for school in the morning. Who cares about going to bed? I'm going to stay up all night long and play Roblox. Ooh. Molly, I wouldn't say that was a good idea. I have to. Look at me. I'm at noob status. I, I have to become a pro. <laughs> well, that's going to take about a year. What are you going to do? Stay awake that whole time? If I have to, I will. <laughs> Molly, you're so ridiculous. <sighs> oh, well, I'm going to bed because it's getting really late. Good luck not being a noob anymore. Thanks. I think I'm going to be great at this game. We're sorry. You're still a noob. What? I've been playing this game for two hours. I should be an expert by now. Ugh. I need something to keep me awake. I know. I'm a noob. Guess what? You were too. So what? I'm a noob. Guess what? Gonna be better than you. Sitting here sweating. Yeah, I'm burning my eye. Molly? Uh, Molly, are you okay? Daisy. Oh, I see you're still a noob. <laughs> Didn't work out for you, huh, Molly? Daisy, go away. Oh, Molly, did you stay up all night long? Yeah. How am I ever going to make it through school today now? And I'm still a noob. <laughs> I guess you're just going to have to drink lots and lots of coffee. Yeah, a good, good idea. Must get to school. Have to get to school. Can't get detention. Molly, come on, let's go. Um, Molly, uh, did you forget something? Oh, man, my backpack. I'm just so tired. No, Molly, you're still wearing your pajamas. Oh, oh man, hold on a second. Hobby, we're going to be late. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming. Hold your horses. Molly, I really don't want to get detention because you decided to be late again. Oh. I'm just so tired. I can't believe I stayed up all night. It didn't even work. I'm still a noob in Roblox. Molly, I think it's pretty safe to say you're always going to be a noob. Ooh. Gee, thanks. Daisy, wait. Stop a Starbucks. Really? You already drank like three cups of coffee. Yeah, but it's not enough. I need a shot of espresso. Stop! Where's the workers? Ugh. Doesn't anybody work here? Okay, I'll just make my own. Who knew that Starbucks would be self-checkout? Did you get enough of your coffee yet, Molly? Not even. I got this one, and I drank one when I was still inside. Molly, you're gonna spend the entire school day in the bathroom. <laughs> Probably, but at least I'll be awake. Molly, would you like to join us for class, or um, do you need a nap like a little kindergartner? <laughs> Molly, wake up. Oh, yeah, she's totally getting detention again, loser. Oh, yeah. oh, I, gotta, I gotta be an expert. I don't want to be a new. <sighs> oh, did she just fart in her sleep? That's so disgusting. Teacher, I want to be excused. Oh, what? What's going on? Did, did I just fall asleep? Uh, yeah, Molly. And, um, you too. Yes. Oh, <laughs> sorry about that. Molly, I don't know why you're sleeping in class today, but I would suggest getting a good night's sleep tonight because you're going to get detention tomorrow if you can't stay awake. Class, you're dismissed for lunch. Daisy was right. I am spending my entire day in the bathroom. Molly, are you okay? Are you getting sick or something? Yeah, she's getting sick of being a noob in Roblox. So she got a new gaming rig, stayed up all night trying to be, well, an expert at Roblox, and you can see what happened. Oh, Molly, you should have tried to get some sleep. Yeah, I think I learned my lesson, but right now I just need more caffeine. Like a lot more. Glug, 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 glug. Or I'm not going to make it through gym class today. 
Yeah, and today we get to swim in the pool. You love that, Molly. I know, but all I can think about right now is putting my head down on the pillow and... Molly, wake up! Don't fall asleep again! <laughs> I was actually sleeping while I was drinking this Coke. That's crazy. Unless you're a fish. Do fish drink water? And if they do, do they drink it while they're sleeping? That's a big question. I'm gonna have to research that. I didn't want to know for like real. Why not? That's a really cool question. Oh, Daisy. Do you ever do anything besides research and homework? Not really. It's my life. Wow. This thing's empty already. Now we need another one. Um, Molly, that is a lot of soda. <laughs> You're gonna get a tummy ache. Nah, I'll be fine. Glug, 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 glug. I'm finally feeling awake. Now come on, let's go to gym class. Molly, are you sure that you're okay? Fine. Molly, how many of those sodas did you drink? Um, seven? What? Molly, oh my gosh. <laughs> well, I'm awake now though. Come on, before we're late. <laughs> I have so much energy, I have so much energy. Whoa, Molly, are you okay? Everybody's asking me that all day, of course I'm okay. Um, maybe you should drink less caffeine. Caffeine. Yeah, but then I would have been less awake and now I'm ready to swim in the pool. Na, 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 na. Okay, Molly. <laughs> I just found out that when you drink caffeine, you go crazy. <laughs> yeah, so whatever. All right, let's go to the um, pool and start gym class because I'm so excited. Hello, class. Today, we are going to be doing swimming. Swimming, swimming. You are so lucky that your school actually has a pool. I know, I know, I know, I know. Okay, can you make less noise? You're making my ears hurt. I can't help it, I can't help it, I can't help it. I drink seven sodas at gym. <laughs> OMG, I can't believe they even sell sodas in the lunchroom. That is so unhealthy. Where's Sarah? She didn't make it. Sarah is going to get her bathing suit. She'll be here soon. You worry about you, Molly, and let Sarah worry about Sarah. Everybody in the pool, please. Okay. Whoa, <laughs> that was really cold. The first thing I want you to do is swim from one side of the pool to the other, starting with Molly, then Brookie, then Daisy. Um, that's totally out of order. Just do what I said, please. Oh, our gym teacher can be so grunch, gr grumpy. Molly, you can't even talk right. I think you need to go home and go to bed. No, I'm full of energy. I've got this. And back, Molly. I have so much energy, I should drink seven sodas every day. Ow. I would not recommend that, Molly. I would not recommend it. Okay, next, please. <laughs> Brookie, that's you. Oh, sorry. <laughs> wow, look at her. She's good at swimming. I want to swim like that. Well, you have to practice, Molly. Holy guacamole. Brookie, you're like the fastest swimmer we have. And Daisy, let's see what you've got. Wow, Daisy, you've improved a lot with your swimming. Uh-oh. I think I have to go to the bathroom again. Teacher, 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 teacher. What? I have to go to the bathroom. No, there's no bathroom breaks until after class. If you were to get out with wet feet and slip on the floor and crack your head, that would be my responsibility. You'll have to hold it. If you even have to go and you're not trying to skip class, I will be well, Molly. I'm not trying to, really. I drank seven sodas at lunch and I had coffee this morning and I drank like so much stuff last night. I have to go to the bathroom for real. No, no, and no. Now more laps. Oh boy, I really have to go potty. Okay, there's one lap. Can I go now? Absolutely not. Mrs. Kramer, we need you to report to the principal's office. Mrs. Kramer, please report to the principal's office. Ha <laughs> ha, you're getting in trouble. Uh -oh. What? No, I'm not. I'm a teacher. I don't get the, in trouble with the principal. You seem kind of flustered, Mrs. Kramer. Maybe you are in trouble. You're going to get detention. <gasps> Do not get out of this pool while I'm gone. I'll be right back. Daisy, I really have to go potty. Molly, she said don't get out of the pool. What should I do then? I mean, 
I'm about to pee in my bathing suit. Yeah. No, Monty, don't do that. <laughs> what, I mean, the pool is full of water and no one would ever know. Ew, gross. I would know. I know, but I really have to go. Molly, I'm going to warn you now. If you pee in a public pool, they put dye in there that changes the color of the pool so everybody knows if you've peed. What? That's the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. That's a myth. Oh, look. Gym class with a bunch of losers. Just my luck. Well, that's rude, Sarah. Oh, I guess I better get in the water so I don't get detention. <laughs> Sarah, you made a huge splash. What are you trying to say, that I'm fat? What? No. Listen, loser. If we're going to share a lane, don't talk to me. Um, okay. The teacher should be back soon, though, so she might make you talk to me because, you know, teamwork and stuff. We're all on this swim team together. Oh, I really have to go to the bathroom. What am I going to do? Hold it, Molly. Hold what? Nothing. No one's going to even know. I mean, this pool is full of water. They're not going to know if I just, you know, go pee in here. Wow, this water was freezing, and now it's, like, really warm. <laughs> yeah, sure is. <sighs> oh, this water got really warm all of a sudden. <laughs> what is that water? Marley, you didn't! What? What, me? No, I, I didn't do anything. Molly, did you pee pee in the pool? Uh -oh. I'm out of here. Gross, Molly. Well, I told the teacher I, I had to go. What? Did you pee in the pool? Oh, my God. That's disgusting. I'm going to tell everybody on Snapchat. Uh, guys, I don't see where it's that bad. I mean, it's just over there a little bit. Molly, gross. I, I don't even want to be here. I'm out of here. <laughs> well, I told the mean gym teacher that I had to go to the bathroom. She didn't believe me. Mean gym teacher, huh? Oh, uh, um, Mrs. Kramer, yeah, uh. What is that in the pool? <gasps> Did someone pee in the pool? I told you, Molly, that the water changes a different color if pee is in it. Who did this? Well, I told you I had to go to the bathroom and you didn't believe me. <gasps> I cannot believe this. We're going to have to empty the pool now. Clean everything. Start all over. Well, maybe I should listen to students when we have to go to the bathroom. Oh, this means we're going to miss swimming. And the swim team's going to lose because of you. Well, it's not my fault I had to go to the bathroom. Uh, Molly, maybe you shouldn't have stayed up so late so that you didn't have to drink seven sodas, three coffees, and everything else in sight. Okay, well, whatever, but I still had to go to the bathroom. Actually, I kind of have to go again. <laughs> Since the bathroom's a long walk, and this already has pee in it. I guess we're going to go again. Ah. Oh, detention for the rest of your life. That's okay. I'm used to having detention for my entire life anyway. Ah, so much better. Ew, Molly. That's gross. Hey, everybody. I'm making this Snapchat because the school pool has been closed down due to Molly Acker peeing in it. Y'all should make sure to make fun of her when you see her after school today. What a loser. Oh, I'm so glad the school day is over. Tonight, I'm not going to stay up all night playing Roblox. Oh, look. There's Molly. She's so cool. Just kidding. She's the loser who pees in the pool. Hey there, Sprinkles. Oh, today has been the worst day of my life. Oh, I can't wait to go home. Molly, are you playing that game again? Are you serious? Ugh, oh, this is so annoying. I don't want to be a noob anymore. Obviously, you're going to be a noob for the rest of your life. You cannot stay up late again tonight. Go to bed, Molly. It's bedtime. Okay, just, just a few more minutes. Just just a couple more minutes. Ay, ay, ay. She'll never learn. Good night, Molly. Uh-huh, yep, yep. I'll be going to bed in a minute. So so I'm a man. noob. Guess what? Guess you what? were too. So what? So I'm a noob. Guess what? Gonna Guess be what? better than you. Sitting here sweating. Yeah, I'm burning my eye. Daisy, can't you drive?
drive any faster? If I'm late for school today, I'm going to get detention. I've never been late in the entire history of me going to school. Yes, but I also want to stop at Starbucks for just a minute. Molly, we cannot get a latte. We'll be late for school. Oh, come on, Daisy. Just step on the gas. I need my latte. All right, fine. But make it quick, Molly. And I mean it. I will. And I'm going to get a donut, too. I'm starving. Molly, come on. I know. I'm coming. I'm coming. Mm. Too hot. Too hot. Mm. This donut's delicious. Blueberry with blueberry frosting. My favorite. Molly, if you're late again, you really are going to get detention. No problem. Right on time. Mm. Oh, so good. Chimney Cricket! I almost forgot my math book. Mm, I was so distracted by this donut. Hey, Molly. Good morning. Hey, Luke. What's up? Um, not much. Ooh, what are you eating? That smells delicious. What does it look like? A donut. <laughs> you want a bite? Sure. I'd love to have a bite. Thanks. Just kidding. I'm going to eat it all myself. Molly, that wasn't very nice. <laughs> well, maybe I can be nicer to you by inviting you to my house this weekend. And we can have popcorn, watch a movie, that kind of thing. Do you want to? <laughs> oh, sorry, Molly. I'd love to, but I can't. All right, I'm sorry about the donut, okay? Here, you can have some of my donut. Is this another trick? No, of course not. I'll share my donut with you. I really like you. I mean, as a friend and stuff. Uh-huh, sure. I still can't come over this weekend. Well then, no donut for you! I never knew a girl that liked donuts as much as you. And pizza! Don't forget about the pizza. So why can't you come over this weekend? You gotta hang out with your parents or something? Boring! Actually, no, I was invited to a party. <gasps> a party? Whoa, what kind of party? A kid's birthday party or something? <laughs> no, um, Logan's having a party and he invited me. Logan's having a party? Well, I'm friends with Logan, too, so must be he just, like, forgot to send me an invitation or maybe got lost in the mail. Oh, I, I don't really know, Molly, but, um, yeah, I should probably get to class. Wait a minute. No, we're not done talking about this party. Luke! What is it, Molly? Hold on. I want to ask you more questions, but I still have to finish my donut. Molly, we're going to be late for class. What is it? Well, I was just wondering, um, what kind of party is it? Because I'm pretty sure he should have invited me. It's a water park party. Say what? Now I know that my invitation got lost because Logan would know that I love water parks and he would have definitely invited me, Luke. What's going on? I'm sorry, Molly, but it's a boys only party. No girls allowed. Say what? <gasps> That's not fair. Just because I'm a girl, I can't come to the party? Well, yeah, I mean, no girls allowed. Not just you, not Daisy, not Brookie, not anybody. No, I have to get to class. Come on, we don't want to be late. This is so uncool. They're having a boys-only water park party, but but I want to go too, and I'm their friend. This stinks. I've got to do something about this. Hey, guys, you ready for this awesome guys-only water park day? Yeah, totally. Hey, Kyle, why are you looking so bummed? I don't know, guys. I just thought maybe we'd have a pizza party instead. What? Dude, we're at the water park. Look at all this amazing stuff to do. Volcano, Lazy River, Mermaid Lagoon, Cafe. I mean, come on. They've got pizza here, dude. Yeah, I guess it's just because like, I'm not the best swimmer. What? What? You don't want to swim? Well, we're not going to the ocean. It's just the water park. You'll be okay. Do you want us to get you like a floaty or something? No, I don't need a floaty. I I'm fine, okay? All right, man, we're just not trying to pick on you or anything. We just want you to be having fun and, like, feel safe and stuff. I'm good. I just, I'm not, like, the biggest fan of water parks. That's all. Ugh, Kyle, you're gonna have fun. Just chill. Guys, wait for me. I want to get in the lazy river. Whoa, this is so relaxing and cool. Yeah, dude, thanks for inviting us. We love this party so far. Right, Kyle? Yeah, it's cool. When are we gonna eat pizza? Um, soon enough. Alright, let's talk about our favorite monster trucks. Mine's definitely Grave Digger. Well, mine's Monster Mud. What do you think, Kyle? Bounty Hunter, for sure. Boys only party. That is so rude. Gonna make sure they don't see me, though. 
And that Kyle, he keeps looking all around because he's afraid of the water. I just can't believe it. Why wouldn't they invite me? I mean, I know I'm a girl and stuff, but I mean, I'm tons of fun. And I want to be at the water park with my friends. This stinks. I double dog dare you to go down Volcano Volley. I think I'm more of a mermaid madness type of guy. Come on, Kyle. Come down Volcano Volley. It's going to be so awesome. <laughs> well, here goes nothing. It does look kind of fun. I'm kind of nervous. Whoa! Whoa! I slipped! Oh no! They're gonna catch me! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> it's kind of fun now! <laughs> I'm at the party whether they like it or not! Whoa! <laughs> oh my gosh, that was insane! And so much fun! Hey, wait a minute. Did that just sound like Molly? I don't know, maybe it was just the volleyballs dropping or the beach balls or whatever they are. No, that was definitely Molly! Molly, what are you doing here? I told you, this was a boys-only party. Well, I just think that's stupid. I mean, why can't I be here? I'm your friend. Because you're a girl, duh. You can't be at the party? Now, get out. No, you can't make me. Nah, 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 nah. Get her! What? Uh-oh. Better run! Why can't I run any faster? Ah, this Roblox game is so annoying. I have to run super slow. And also, I'm totally getting distracted by the ice cream treats. Okay, how far behind me is he? Oh, no time to stop for an ice cream treat. Molly, seriously, get out of here. This water park party is for me and my friends only. I am one of your friends. Forget already? No, I didn't forget already. It's just your girl. Well, that's... Ugh. That's so dumb! A few minutes later... And don't come back, Molly! This is a boys-only water park party! How oh, is it? Well, I think I'll have a girls-only water park party, and it'll be way more amazing than you ever could imagine! Okay, girls, I've gathered you here for a very special water park party! Yay! Oh my gosh, Molly, this is gonna be so much fun! But why couldn't, um, Logan and... Luke and everyone come. What? Don't say their names to me again. Uh, Molly, put down the pool noodle. Oh, sorry. It's just making me feel a little frustrated to hear their names. What? Why? Yeah, Molly, why? Because they had a boys-only water park party and they didn't invite any of us. Wait, what? I know, Serena, isn't that so annoying? And when I tried to show up and, well, uh, crash their party, they chased me off just because I didn't know what monster truck was my favorite. Whoa, boring. Anyway, we're going to have so much fun at this girls-only water park. And no boys allowed. Exactly. Come on, guys. Let's start with the water slides. Or should I say, come on, girls. <laughs> what? The lazy river. I changed my mind. You start here. Let's start here. You can ride in a little boat if you can ever get in it, but sometimes it's hard to sit in. All right, there we go. What? Luke is here? Don't worry, Molly. He's not allowed to be here with us. It's girls only, remember? Yeah, exactly. Girls only. So, Serena, which one should we go down first? Come on, Bricky. I'm going to go down Volcano Volley. Me too. Let's go. <laughs> wow! <laughs> this is so much fun! Whee! <laughs> I'm having the time of my life at this girls only water park party. Whoa, Molly, you almost landed right on top of me. Sorry, Serena, I didn't know you were going to be right there. It's basically because we both went down the water slide at the same time. Hey, thanks for inviting me to this party. It's super fun. Yeah, no problem. Come on, let's go do some other fun things. OMG, Molly, look at Mermaid Lagoon. This is amazing. I know I'm going to dive down and see all these amazing crystals and stuff. Whoa, so cool. Holy guacamole. Pirate Bay? <laughs> look, there's pirates over there. OMG. Wait a minute. Is he a boy? Okay, you can't be at this water park party. I don't care if you're a pirate or what. Give me all the treasure and the narg. 
Get out of here! This is a girls only party! Hi, welcome to Pirate Bay! I'm a pirate! Arg! A mully. He's an animatronic. He's not even real. But he's still a boy! He can't be here! It's a girls only party! Arg! Welcome to Pirate Bay! Huh. Well, I guess you're allowed since you're a robot. <laughs> This girls only water park party has been so much fun. Molly, can I come to your party? What? Is that Luke over there? Absolutely not! <laughs> girls only! Oh. <laughs> to wear for the party. <laughs> I look so adorable. Daisy, Daisy, I've got big news. Where are you, Daisy? What are you yelling about, Cheesh? What are you wearing, Molly? <laughs> You're wearing a cat hat and a bikini. Molly, it's winter. I know, but I've decided I'm tired of winter already. Oh boy, you've got a long way to go, Molly. I know, but I, I need to have like a vacation and since we're all kind of stuck here and can't go anywhere, I thought we'd have a vacation at home. Um, okay. Uh, what are you thinking about? I'm thinking I'm going to invite Berkey Cookie over for a giant party and maybe we'll go in the pool. Molly, it's freezing out. The pool is heated, but the ale is not, Molly. Brr, it's like 20 degrees out. That's why I'm wearing a hat. Because when I'm in the pool, my body will be warm by the water because the pool is heated. And my head will be outside the water, but it'll be warm because I'm wearing this big fuzzy cat hat. Oh boy, Molly, I see your logic. It kind of makes sense, right? Um, well, uh, yeah, sure. Okay, well, Brookie's going to be here any minute. I've got to go make some snacks. Ooh, snacks sounds good. I'm down for some snacks. Okay, let's see what we've got. Um... Oh, we've got a lot of stuff I can make. Let's see. Oh, I know Brookie Cookie uh, loves fruit salad. Um, She loves eating healthy and stuff. And I actually like fruit a lot too. So I'm going to cut up some fruit. And I'm going to eat this muffin. Mm, it was super delicious. Daisy, you're not supposed to eat the food. You're supposed to help me make it. Why don't you make something too? Anything you want. This is supposed to be like a summer party. Okay, Molly, if you say so. La, 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 la. Okay, now I've got to mix all the fruit together. Oh, this fruit is so sticky. <laughs> yeah, Molly, that's what happens. You have to wash your hands after you make fruit salad. I still can't believe you're in your bikini. <laughs> I can't wait till Boogie Cookie sees it. She's going to think it's hilarious. Oh, you put out watermelon. That's an awesome summer treat. And some grape juice and stuff. Ooh, somebody's at the door. Um, are you gonna go get it? Ah, uh, yeah, unless you want to, girl in the cat hat. <laughs> no, I want my outfit to be a surprise for Brookie. Hey, Daisy, I'm so excited for the party! Wait till you see Molly. You're not even gonna believe it. Really? Why? What's wrong? Whoa, Molly, what are you wearing? Um, I'm wearing my bikini and a cat hat. <laughs> Why are you wearing that? I mean, it's adorable and all, but weird. Um, because we're going outside, we're going to pretend it's summer, because I'm sick of winter, and I'm getting in the pool. The pool is heated, so don't worry, my body will be warm, but my head will be cold, because it'll be outside the pool, so that's why I'm wearing this really warm hat. Don't ask, Bookie, don't ask. Um, mm, this fruit salad's delicious. Mm. Well, I'm going to try some. Marty made it especially for you, Bookie, because she knows how much you love fruit salad. Oh, that's so nice. You guys are my best friends. You're our best friend, too. Okay, let's get this party started. Molly, it's getting dark. It's going to be even colder out right now. Brr! Oh, oh, and it's raining. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. I think it's awesome. Come on, I dare you to jump in the pool. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> oh, God, it's freezing. Oh, <laughs> this is so much fun. Come on, Daisy. You only freeze for like the first minute. Okay, here I go. Woo! I'm wearing all my clothes because I packed my bathing suit away till next summer. Plus, maybe I'll be warmer if I'm wearing clothes. Nope. Still freezing. Hold it right there. 
Are you three in the pool right now? Huh? What, what, what was that sound? Well, first I heard a siren, and then I heard um, what sounds to be a police officer. Um, I need you to exit the pool immediately, please. Oh. My. Gosh. It's Sarah! Whoa! And she's wearing a police uniform. What's going on here? What, what are you doing? Excuse me, you're not allowed to be in the pool. Oh, uh, Sarah, we're standing right in front of you. You don't have to use a megaphone. I like to use it. It makes me feel very important. Okay, yeah, but can you just tell us what you're saying? Because I don't understand. You're not allowed to be in the pool. It's winter. It's against the rules. The rules of who? Of Bloxburg, duh. I don't remember that being a rule. Well, I'm the police officer. I am. That's right, me. I went to police officer school. So I made a new rule. No swimming in Blacksburg in the winter. Well, that's a silly rule because you're at my house and I'm in my pool. Too bad. If you don't get out of there right now, I'm going to arrest you. Well, Marty, listen to what she says. Nope, not going to do it. Besides, if I get out of the water, I'm going to be freezing cold. Burr. Um, newsflash, I'm in charge here because I'm the police officer. Yeah, and you're being rude. I don't think so, Sarah. Yeah, Sarah, well, that is pretty rude. You two should be quiet or you're going to end up in prison. <laughs> yeah, you're going to make us go to prison because we were swimming in the pool in the winter? Whatever. Yeah, whatever. That's it. I'm going to give you one more second to get out of that pool. And if you don't, I'm going to take you to jail. Wow, Molly, she sounds serious. Come on, we could go inside and have a good time. No way! I'm in the pool and I'm having fun. La 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 Molly, she's got the taser! Watch out! Take that! Ah! You tased me! Ah! And now you're under arrest. Come with me. Molly, no! What are you doing? Sarah, let me out of here right now! You do the crime, you do the time. But that's a silly rule. Who made that rule up? I told you, I'm the officer, so I get to make up any rule I want. That's not how that works. Sarah, you're a terrible police officer. And you're also a terrible person sometimes. Well, kind of all the time. <laughs> I know. <laughs> uh, I'm so cold and hungry. <laughs> Well, at least I could get under these covers. Maybe maybe that would keep me warm. Okay. And I've got a toilet, so you know. I guess things aren't so bad. Uh, uh, there's no heat down here. I'm freezing. Molly? Molly, where are you? Molly! Molly, where are you? Oh my gosh, Daisy. I think she has her in an underground prison. Molly? Huh? What? 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 Brookie! Oh my god, it's freezing down here. It's freezing! Molly! Oh my gosh, I can't believe she put you in an underground prison. I think she's lying about it being a cop. She's an imposter! I kind of gathered that. Now, can you figure out how to open the door? <laughs> Never! And now, since your friends are trying to break you out, they're going to prison too! <laughs> okay, um, Sarah, we get it. We broke your fools. Uh, how long do we have to be in here? When can we get out? <laughs> you think you can get out? You can't get out. <laughs> You're in here for life. <laughs> no! So, Molly, are you telling the truth? Yeah, I am. Isn't that crazy? But don't tell anybody, okay? Molly, your secret is safe with me. Oh, good. <laughs> Not even my sister or anybody knows about this. Wow, just me? Yep. Oh, I gotta go. My sister Daisy's here. What are you keeping secrets about, Molly? Um, nothing. Nothing. You and Bookie Cookie have a secret, and you're not telling me. That's not nice, Molly. Well, it's just between her and I, okay? And it's not really a secret or anything, so don't worry about it. Just forget about it. Okay, Molly, but I don't think you're telling the truth. I am, Daisy. I am. Uh -huh, sure, Molly. Oh, that was a close one. I can't let my sister know what's going on. I'm just going to go out here and check on things. Make every sure everything's okay. What is Molly up to? I'm going to follow her into the backyard. 
Is my sister following me right now? She is! Daisy, what do you want? Molly, you're hiding something, and I want to know what it is right now. Daisy, I'm not hiding anything. I swear, I'm just going for a walk. You're going for a walk in the backyard. Yeah, we have a big backyard. Yeah, not that big, Molly. What do you think? It's like an Olympic stadium or something? <laughs> no, but look at all the woods we have. I like walking through the trees and... Liar, Molly! You're lazy. You don't go for walks. That's not true. If there's a cupcake on the walk, I'll go. Oh, brother. Girls, do you want a snack? I can make you something. I'm getting a snack. Bye, Daisy. Molly, this isn't over. You have to tell me what you're hiding. Nope, not going to do it. Nope, nope, nope. Mom, will you make us a snack? Of course I will. What were you thinking you wanted? Um, Can we have something delicious and like a treat? Mm, yeah, you girls ate really healthy today. I guess you can have a treat. <laughs> Woohoo! I'm ready for it, Mom. So, Molly, are you going to tell me what this little secret is? What secret? What are you girls talking about? There's no secret! Daisy, shh! Oh, you don't want Mom to know the secret. Um, if there was a secret to tell, then everyone could know what it is. But there's no secret! There's a secret. And I'm gonna find out what it is! So, anyway, Mom, what are you making us? Something really delicious! Okay, let's see. There's flour, milk, and a cupcake pan. <gasps> Mom, are you making me cupcakes? <laughs> Maybe. Oh, you're the best mom ever. I love you, mom. I seriously love you, love you, love you. Okay, girls, here's your delicious cupcakes. I don't have any frosting, sorry. That's okay, mom. Who needs frosting? Hmm. These are delicious. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Yum. Cheapest Molly, you're gonna save some cupcakes for the best of us? Uh huh, sure. Hmm. So good. Ugh. Molly, take your time. You're gonna get a stomach ache. Um, I'm gonna eat this last cupcake in the backyard. See you guys later. What? Why does she want to eat it outside? I don't know. Maybe she just wants some fresh air, Daisy. Everybody needs fresh air sometimes. Oh, okay. I've got to save this. Um, you know, I want to make sure she has enough to eat. Molly, what on earth are you doing? Daisy, what are you do Why are you following me? Molly, you better tell me what this secret is right now. Okay, fine, but you can't tell anybody. Do you promise? I promise, Molly. What is it? Daisy, why are you swimming so weird? I don't know. I'm just kind of stuck in the water. <laughs> you look really weird right now. Oh, because you have an expert swimmer. Um, okay, see you later, Daisy. Molly, you just tried to distract me. Tell me what the secret is, please, Molly. Please, please, please. Okay. I found a baby mermaid. What? No, you didn't. You're a liar. That's not true. It's true. I was on my way home from school one day, and you know how you just walk past that one part of the river? Yeah. Well, there was a baby mermaid in there. What? Yep. It's totally true. And she needed my help. So I brought her home, and I made her a nursery in our pool. I don't believe you, Molly. If you don't believe me, just follow me. Where are you going? Swim down. Swim down, Daisy. Molly, why are you swimming through the filter of the pool? Whoa, what is this place? I told you. I made a nursery for my baby mermaid. Molly, I don't know what's going on right now. This nursery is adorable, but I don't see a baby mermaid. Okay, What? There's a baby mermaid. <laughs> I told you there was a baby mermaid. Oh my god, she's beautiful. Thank you, I think she's adorable too. Oh, beautiful mermaid. So now you know why you gotta keep this baby mermaid a secret. Like, I'm pretty sure everyone would freak out if they knew there was a baby mermaid in town. Everyone would want to adopt her. No, I don't want everyone to adopt her. I want her to be a part of our family. I get to do it way I tell ya. I get gotcha, Papa. Wow, Molly, what's her name? Her name's Baby Kira. Wow, she's adorable. Thank you. And also, I just can't believe it. I can't believe I found a baby mermaid. This just doesn't happen every day. No, Molly, it really doesn't. Give me a tour around the nursery. And this is her little crib. And her cute little pictures are above. 
there's a little chair that I can sit and rock her in if she needs that before she goes to sleep. Here's her changing table with her changing pad and there's a box of diapers and wipes. Here's her little closet where she can get dressed. She is so cute. Some really cute outfits, like, well, basically just tops because her bottoms, you know, she's got a tail. So, um, she can't wear, like, pants or anything. And then over here is a dresser where I just keep, like, extra toys and stuff. Wow, Molly, this is adorable. I love the pictures and the paintings on the walls. She even has a pet octopus doll. That's adorable. Yeah, I think so, too. <laughs> um, so, yeah, this is basically her room. Well, Molly, you can't keep her. What do you mean I can't keep her? Why not? Because, Molly, she has to go back in the ocean where she belongs. What? No! She's my baby mermaid. I found her, and, and I love her. She's like my sister. Molly, you can't keep her. Besides, Mom will find out. No, she won't. Nope, I'm going to keep her down here until she's 18. No one will ever know. Molly, you can't do that. Girls, where are you? Oh, baby Kira. My sweet little mermaid baby. You stay down here, okay? Um, and I'll bring you a bottle soon, okay? I'll be right back. Coming, Mom! Mom, we're coming! Now don't breathe a word of this to Mom! Okay, Molly. Don't tell me what. Are you girls keeping a secret? No, we don't have any kind of secret. Why would we be doing that? I mean, we were just in the pool because we wanted to go for a swim, not because we have a secret. Daisy! Wait, is the secret in the pool? Who said anything about a secret? I don't have a secret. There's not a secret under the pool. Daisy! Ugh, my sister's terrible at keeping secrets. Okay, time to see what's underneath the pool. Nothing! Nothing! Don't go in the pool, Mom! There might be a sea monster in there. Molly, don't be ridiculous. Ah, oh, this water's cold. Mom, don't go down there. Molly! Oh, great, Daisy. You spilled the beans. Well, not technically. What is going on down here? Um, nothing, Mom. Nothing at all. Oh, my gosh. Is that a baby mermaid? Um, nope. You're just seeing things. Molly, how long have you had this baby mermaid? Um, like a week. And you set up this nursery for her? Yeah, I, I didn't want her to be alone. Oh, Molly, that's so nice of you. Maybe we could adopt her. Really? She she doesn't have to leave? Well, it's up to it's up to the baby mermaid. What's her name? Her name's baby Kira. Little mermaid, do you want to go back to the ocean? I don't know. No mommy, no daddy. Oh my gosh, she has no mom and dad. Well, we'll be her mom and dad. Okay, baby, I've got to go pick up some milk and diapers. No, Mom, I did all that. I I've got it all. Come on, I'll show you. Molly, what happened? I was too afraid to go down there. I thought you were going to be grounded forever. No, Mom says we can adopt the baby mermaid. Really? Yes, girls, but you're not allowed to keep secrets from me, okay? Okay, Mom, I promise, no more secrets. I did take it one by my daddy, What? When she gets out of the water, she has legs! What? Are you kidding me? No! She turns into a human, Mom! Um, that's unexpected. What's she doing? I don't know. What are you doing? I can't be out of my hungry! Oh my gosh, the baby mermaid turned into a little human baby, and now she's eating watermelon out of the refrigerator. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Well, welcome to the family, baby mermaid! <laughs> <laughs> Baby Kira, today is a really important day. It's also a really exciting day. Do you know why? No, don't know. Well, I'm going to tell you. Look at this giant poster behind us. Does that give you a clue? No, Molly, no clue. Um, okay, well, I'll give you a hint. Um, you're wearing your bathing suit, so what do you do when you wear your bathing suit? Um, I, I, I put on floaties and I go to the pool. That's exactly right! But today, I'm going to teach you how to swim! No, 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 no! No, I'm afraid! No, no, you don't have to be afraid! The water is super fun! He's so fun when I have floaties. 
I know, but you don't want to be wearing your floaties forever, do you, baby Kira? Maybe. No, 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 baby Kira. Come on, follow me. I'll show you. Um, I, I, I still learning how to walk. I know, you can crawl there. Come on. Okay, I crawl. Okay, good girl. Come on. I hop to. Hop, hop, hop. Hop, 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 hop. <laughs> you know how to hop, but you still don't know how to walk. Well, I have. I, I can walk a little. I know, you can walk a little. Okay, here we go. Here's the pool. Now I want you to watch me. Geronimo! See? And now, under the water, you can see that my legs are moving. That's called treading water. No, no, no. Yes, it is, baby Kira. That's what it's called. No, no, no. Floaties. No, you can't have floaties in the pool today. You're going to learn how to swim for real, baby Kira. No! Baby Kira, are you seriously laying on the ground and having a temper tantrum at the pool? That is very naughty. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> oh, baby. Hey, did you just step on my cousin? Be more careful. Holy moly. She's just a baby. Come on, baby Kira. Um, do you want to go over to the shallow end? Oh my gosh! What what is that guy doing? Oh my gosh, he just Help, help, help. Baby Kira, it's okay. Don't panic. That guy just pushed us in the pool. Can you believe that? It's okay, Baby Kira. I'm right here. Molly, Molly. Okay. Hold still, Baby Kira. Hold still. Baby Kira? Oh, my gosh. She's floating on her back. That's so awesome. Not as scary. That's right. It's not as scary when you're floating. Look how awesome my Baby Kira. Oh, you're doing so awesome, Cousin Baby Kira. Do you want to get out of the pool now? No, fine, fine. Oh, you've changed your mind? You're not going to have a temper tantrum now? No. Oh, my goodness. Watching a baby is so hard. Okay, why don't you try it like this where you're treading water? No, like it like this. You're already doing it, baby Kira. <laughs> oh, you're so much like my sister Daisy. You even kind of talk like her sometimes. I'm still baby. I know you're still a baby. I know. Am I doing good, Molly? You're doing very good, baby Kira. Oh, look. You're treading water just like me. Now watch. I'm going to swim. See how I'm swimming? I'm going to swim back to you. Do you want to try now? No. Afraid. Baby Kira, you don't have to be afraid. I'm right here. Okay, I try. Good girl. Okay. Great job, baby Kira. Baby Kira. Okay, turn around, baby Kira. Oh, my gosh. She's she's a super... That's a deep end. Baby Kira, no. Oh, my gosh. She's swimming to the deep end. Baby Kira, come back. Ah, ah, I, I can't. Ah. Okay, don't panic. Just float on your back, baby Kira. Float on your back. Okay, I'm okay now. Oh, you shouldn't have gone into the deep end. That's why you're having so many problems, baby Kira. Come on, back over to the shallow end. Come on. Come on. You're actually a really good swimmer. Thank you. But let's stick to the shallow end until you're really good. Like, you don't even need any practice. I would like you to keep treading water. I'm going to get out and get a soda. Molly! No, I'm just kidding. I'm going to stay right here. I'm going to make sure you're okay. Of course, I'm not going to go get a soda. I was just kidding. Ooh, slide, slide. Oh, baby Kira, I don't know if you're ready for the water park part of this. Slide, please, Molly, please. Okay, okay. Wow, you could walk really good right there when you were excited about the slide. Why don't you try walking? No, crawl, crawl. Okay, well, crawl over here first. You'll really love this. Ah, doesn't that feel good? Wee, wee, wee. Whoa, it's getting nighttime already. All right, baby Kira, we can go down the slide once, but then we have to get home because you have to go to bed. No nighttime, no nighttime. Yes, nighttime, baby Kira. Yes, you have to. Going up to this awesome slide with my baby cousin Kira. Baby Kira, are you behind me? 
I crawl slow. Okay, well, I don't know how you're gonna get up all these stairs then. Whoa! I'm jumping, jumping, jumping! <laughs> okay, sorry, but that looks really funny. Baby can't slow down! I can't even walk as fast as you can jump crawl. Holy moly, this is a lot of stairs. Uh, uh, uh. I'm getting tired. No! I fell! Okay, baby Kira. Uh, it's getting late. You can't ride a slide. No! No! I don't even know where I fell just now. Oh, great. Where am I? Ay, ay, ay. Now I'm going to lose my cousin and I'm going to get in trouble because I'm not watching her. I think I'm outside the pool. Um, hello? Anybody? Is there any ladders down here or anything? Uh, I'm kind of in trouble because I'm stuck under the building. Hello? Anybody? Okay, this is ridiculous. I guess I'll just go up this thing. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I have no idea where I am right now. Uh, hello? Can anybody help me? Ah! Oh my gosh, I'm gonna die. Seriously, ah! Holy moly, you can walk out into outer space out here. Ah, huh, finally, I made it back to the pool. Now where's baby Kira? I bet she's gonna go down one of these giant slides. Oh my gosh, I hear her! I just don't know where. Oh my gosh, there she goes! There she goes, guys! Whoa! Whoa! Oh my gosh, was that my was that my baby cousin? Oh no, that wasn't my baby cousin. I thought that was my baby cousin, but that wasn't her. Where where is she? Okay, now I'm getting worried because I don't see her. She's not in the pool. OMG! Where'd my baby cousin go? Wee! Baby Kara, was that you? Wee, Molly, wee! I'm still swimming over to see if it's her. It is you! This is light fun! This is light fun! Okay, yes, I know the slide is fun, but you really do need to learn more about swimming. You want to try it again? Yeah. All right, then you have to go home and go to sleep. Okay, Molly. Follow me, baby Kira. Follow me. Swim like I do. Okay, let me see you swim back the other way, please. Great job. Great job. Oh, and she didn't even want to get in the pool in the beginning. And now look at her swimming like a fish. I think I did a really good job teaching her how to swim. Ah! What are you doing, baby Kira? I'm taking my night night. You're taking a night night? No, you can't take a night night here. You have to go home. Never leave. You have to leave. You can't stay at the pool forever. Baby Kira. No, stay. Stay. <laughs> oh no, not again. Okay, Toy Your fans, I've got to get going. My cousin Baby Kira is having another temper tantrum. Don't forget to subscribe to the Toy Heroes channel where we put out awesome videos just like this one every day. <laughs> Baby Kira, that's so naughty. Don't be naughty. <laughs> Alright, guys, I'll see you next time. Wish me luck. Bye! I can't believe it. I'm actually early to school. Oh, I'm actually maybe going to get a good grade, and I'm actually not going to get detention. This is amazing. Well, 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 who do we have here? You know who I am, Sarah. You see me in class every day. Yeah, but I can't even remember your name because you're such a loser with a Ooh. capital L. Sarah, I'm early to school. My homework is done.
done, and I'm not going to get detention. Pfft, you can't ruin my day. Doesn't matter what you say. Well, it should matter. She just called you a loser, so you should bow down to her because she's like a Brookhaven High School god. <laughs> right, Sarah? Um, more like she is so mean and also a bully and, um, well, I don't listen to anything she has to say. Oh, really? You don't? Get her, girls. Ow! Quit hitting me! Time to stuff you in your locker. What? No! No! Stop it! <laughs> Good luck trying to get out of there. Yeah, fatty. You couldn't get out even if you tried. Hey, let me out! Ow! It's, it's hot in here. And ow! Ow! My knees are rubbing against my books. Ouch! Oh, yeah. There's that tuna fish sandwich my mom packed me a month ago. Oh, that's what that smell is. Wow. It's really, really, really tiny in here. I want to get out. I need to get out. You're a loser. You'll always be a loser. And if you don't want to get stuffed in your locker again tomorrow, maybe you'll remember that. <laughs> Come on, girls. Let's go into the cafeteria and tease some more people. Five hours later. Where's Molly? She's going to be late again. I thought you said she left the house early. She did, but I don't know. Maybe she decided to skip school. What's that sound? I don't know, but we better get to class. I don't want detention. Good morning, class. Wait a minute. Where's Molly? Is she late again? Ugh, I'm giving her detention. That's it. She isn't going to just get detention this time. She's going to get in-school suspension today <laughs> that loser's totally locked in in school detention <laughs> i'm sure molly will be here any minute please teacher don't give her in school suspension she she well but you can't say she doesn't deserve it this is my we're talking about if adam has four apples and luke has two how many does sam have oh who cares Apples are boring. Oh, there's the bell. You guys are dismissed, but please do this problem as a part of your homework. I want you all to have the correct answer in the morning. Three hours later. I'm stuck inside my locker <gasps> until the end of time. Stuck inside this locker and I didn't do a crime. Oh. Molly? Is that you? Like once a week in this annoying school. 
Well, I'm ignoring it, and I'm gonna keep doing my hair. Whatever. <coughs> What's that smoke? Oh my god, is the school really on fire? Holy, ah! <coughs> have to get out of the school. It's burning down. <coughs> what? Well, well, well. You think you're leaving, bully? I don't think so. What? There's a demon in the school? Ah! I'm no demon. I'm that loser you stuffed in the locker. Now it's time for you to get stuffed in a locker. Molly, you're being crazy. Seriously, let me out of here. There she is. We, we've spotted her. Let's get her. Stay where you are, Molly. Well, we're going to tase you. How do you know my name? We've been watching you for a while. Seems you have an anger management problem. Um, does anyone want to help me over here? Don't worry. We'll get you free. Right after we take Molly. You're not taking me anywhere. Taser! Special school will be very glad to see you, Molly. We've got a place for kids just like you. What? Where? Where am I? <gasps> I don't feel so good. The last thing I remember, I was... Getting out of my locker after the bully stuffed me in it! Hello. Welcome. What's going on? You have been selected to be a part of our very special school. Here at AM School, we will teach you all about your special abilities. AM School? What's that? Anger management. Whoa, 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 whoa! I only have anger problems when I don't get enough burritos. See my shirt? Feed me burritos. Uh-huh. Well, it just so happens we're having burritos for dinner tonight. Really? Well, this sounds like the place for me. So, what do you do at AM school? I don't have a problem with anger. Oh, really? Ugh, that's not what the news is saying. Citizens of Brookhaven, I am here in front of Brookhaven School, and as you can see, it's burning behind me. This has been the craziest day we've ever had in Brookhaven. I have one of the students with me. Jasper, what happened? Oh, dude, it was the craziest thing I've ever seen. This girl I go to school with, she went crazy, she got angry, and then, like, she just exploded. All this fire started coming out of her hair, and, like, oh, my God, the fire alarms went off. It was the craziest thing I've ever seen. You heard it, heard it here first on Channel 3. Brookhaven School is no more. Now, do you believe me that you have an anger management issue? Um, I can't believe that was me. Believe it. Everyone at your school saw it. Oh, no. Is my sister okay? Is Brookie okay? They're fine. But you definitely need to get control of your powers. Powers? I have powers? And you can choose to use them for good or evil. But you learn to control them so that you can, well, help us. Help you do what? And when do the burritos get here? Help us fight crime, of course. All around Brookhaven. O-M-G! This is the weirdest day of my life! <laughs> I think it's time you start meeting some of the other students at AM school. Um, okay. That over there is Sam. He has super strength when he gets angry. Wow! Hi, Sam. I'm Molly. Hey, what's up? What happens when you get angry? Um, I catch on fire and burn everything down. Whoa, cool. So, you both need to learn to work together to solve all the problems in Brookhaven. How do you think you'd go about that, Molly? I don't know, I just got to this school. Aren't you supposed to be the teacher or headmaster or something? Perhaps we should show Molly trial by fire. Do you think that's such a good idea? I mean, I did just burn down my high school with fire! Hey there, what's up? I'm Brooklyn. Hey, I'm Molly, the fire starter. Oh, <laughs> that's pretty crazy. Tell her what your special anger management trait is. Oh, if I get too angry, um, I let off a noxious gas. Yeah. Whoa, sounds like me when I eat too many bean burritos. Okay, Molly, are you ready for trial by fire? I told you, I think that's a terrible idea. 
I turn into fire when I get angry. Sometimes that's neat, especially when we're fighting bad guys. And I just got word there's somebody robbing the Brookhaven Bank. Get going. Try to take them down. Hey, wait a minute. Do I get like superhero costumes or something? What do you think this is? A comic book? Get going. Take down that bad guy. Fine. I'll try. Are you coming with me, Brooklyn? Are you coming with me, ah! Sam? Yeah, we don't really have a choice here at AM school. We have to do this or we get detention. Seriously? There's detention at this school too? Ugh, I can't escape it. Dun, 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 dun. What are you doing, Molly? It's over here. Yeah, I know, but Superhero needs a cookie before I uh, get to work. Delicious. Dun, 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 dun. Wait a minute. Where's the bank in this game again? How many times have I played Brookhaven and I still don't know where the bank is? Maybe that's because I spend all of my money on Robux. <gasps> look what I did to the school! Okay, not paying attention to that. Oopsie! Molly, look! There's the villain! Let's get him. Um, yeah, but I'm not quite done with my chocolate chip cookie, so mm, that's delicious. Mmm, so good. Hey, hold it right there! Or else what? You're gonna smack me with that chocolate chip cookie, fatty? Ooh. What? What did you just say to me? You heard me, fatty. Too busy stuffing your face to be a superhero. Hey, Sam, can you hold this cookie for me? Don't eat any of it, though. How dare you talk to me that way? Oh, you just lit my hair on fire! Oh. Hey, villain, guess what fire and gas make? Bye-bye. Uh. Uh, Molly, uh, you took care of the supervillain, but uh, you're burning down Brookhaven Bank! Guess somebody better call. 911 fire starters here <laughs> I'm not sure if she's good or evil yet I'm not sure that fire starters powers can be controlled this is bad this is very very bad we've never had a student at AM school that couldn't control their powers until now hi welcome to Brookhaven whoa yeah give me a bean burrito Sorry, we're out of bean burritos. Um, I have hot dogs. What? No bean burritos? A few minutes later. Burn, Brookhaven. Burn. Sandwich is delicious. I'm so hungry. Uh, that's like your fourth sandwich in a row, Laura. Ooh. Yeah, so? Don't judge. I'm hungry, okay? You've been extra hungry this week. And, um, well, uh, you're twice the size. Uh oh What? What are you talking about? No, I'm not. Um, honey, maybe we should get you a gym membership and also wear your pants. Ah! What? Oh, uh, they don't fit anymore. Okay, well, you can't leave the house with no pants. I don't know why I'm so hungry lately, okay? Maybe I'm just stressed out. Ugh, my stomach kind of hurts. I'll be right back. I have to go potty. <coughs> well, maybe you have to go potty because you've eaten four sandwiches. <coughs> Honey, are you okay? I think I know I am so hungry. This happened the last time before Molly came along. You don't think that you're pregnant, do you? <laughs> well, I'm super hungry and I keep throwing up. Yeah. Daddy, I'm hungry. Daddy, I want a snack. Daddy, daddy, daddy. Molly, hold on a second. We're waiting for the doctor to come back and I don't want to miss what she has to say. Yeah, honey, my tummy really hurts and it might mean that, well, you get a new sibling. <laughs> what? A baby? Really? I poop my pants! I poop my pants! Five minutes later. Well, Mrs. Acker, the results are in. You're going to be a mom again. What? I'm going to have another baby? What? Ah! Diapers! So many diapers! Molly's not even out of diapers yet! Now we're going to have another baby? I don't know if I can do this! 
It's, it's going to be insane. But honey, think about it. You may have a son this time. Someone you could pal around with. Someone who could be your best friend. Wow, a son. I can see it now. Hey, son, you are ready to play some video games? Yeah, Dad, look at me. <laughs> I look just like you. Whoa, did you grow a mustache already? <laughs> You're only three years old. Oh, I'm so proud of you. Wow. Um, honey, I know this is your dream about our son, but I think the mustache is a little bit far-fetched. Okay, okay, yeah. My son's not gonna have a mustache at three. So, Dan Jr., <laughs> you wanna play some video games? You bet I do, Dad. Let's play games together. This is gonna be so much fun. Whoa, this VR game is so cool, Dad. Back in my day, this... Oh! Oh! We just had classic games, and now I know why. Oh, I ran into the couch. Dad, <laughs> you're silly. You're supposed to stay in the area that the game is in. What? But but the bad guy was getting me. <laughs> Dad, I love spending time with you. Aww. I love spending time with you too, son. Come on, let's go mow the lawn. See, son, this is how we mow the lawn. Got it? Yeah, Dad, I think I got it. Oh, this is the perfect reason to have kids. Good job, Dan Jr. Keep it up. Dad, you're the best dad there ever was. Oh, Dan Jr., you're the best son there ever was. Mr. Acker, Mr. Acker, snap out of it. Your wife's about to give birth. Wait, what? Oh, I just found out she was pregnant five minutes ago. I was thinking about my son and what? Now you're saying she's gonna have the baby? Well, just because you found out five minutes ago doesn't mean she just got pregnant five minutes ago. Did the fact that she was getting fatter and fatter not say anything to you? I just thought she was eating too many sandwiches. This baby's coming right now. Ah! Honey, it's going to be okay. Everything's going to be fine, right? I mean, two kids in diapers. Everything's going to be good, right? I don't know. All I can think about right now is I want a sandwich. No more sandwiches. You, you've got to have this baby. And it's going to be the perfect little boy. I can just see his angel face now. I want a baby brother or sister. I'm the baby. <laughs> well, honey, not anymore. Congratulations, Mr. and Mrs. Acker and Molly. <laughs> You're a big sister now. Wow. Let me see my son. I bet he's like a little angel. Son? Oh no, Mr. Acker. You have a new little baby girl. <laughs> what? No, it's a boy. Check again. No, it's a girl. Put it back. I want it remade. I want a boy. Uh, just so you know, we're not putting the baby back. It's out now, and it's a girl. So you don't have to deal with that, Dan. It's a girl. But, but, I wanted a son. So disappointing. I, I already have a daughter. I don't need two. Well, Mr. and Mrs. Acker, I suggest you get used to having two daughters because that's exactly what you have. <gasps> daddy, 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 can we watch Coco Melon? No, Molly. <laughs> Baby's been crying all day. Your mom's at work. I just want to sit and watch Survivor for a few minutes. Come on, come and sit and watch it with me. I don't like Survivor. That that show is bleh. I want to watch Baby Shark do 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 do. No, please don't sing that. Baby Shark do do. Molly. Wee, wee. Oh, the baby's awake. If it was a boy, it wouldn't cry this much. <laughs> oh, you have another poopy diaper? If it was a boy, he wouldn't poop this much. <laughs> There's too much pink around this house. Everything's pink. If it was a boy, there wouldn't be this much pink. Something tells me that dad doesn't like my baby sister. Well, neither do I. Daisy and I are going to be arch nemesis. <laughs> Molly, you're supposed to love your sister. Well, you don't. What? Okay, I wanted a boy. I'll admit it. Oh, 
This lawnmower broke again. Watch out, Daisy. I need to fix this. I can fix it if you want me to. What? No, you can't. Yeah, I can, but this. Hey, you're gonna break my lawnmower. What are you doing? No, no, no. It's gonna work better. If I had a boy, this wouldn't be a problem. Ugh, she's gonna try to fix my lawnmower and then she's gonna break it. <laughs> Wish I didn't have a daughter. I just wanted a son. I'm fixed. Okay, Dad, stand back. This is gonna be amazing. Watch this, Dad! Is that a remote-controlled lawnmower? Daisy, are you serious right now? Am I gonna have to mow the lawn and when it's 100 degrees? You... You're a cheat! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Someone pour me a Coca-Cola because I'm gonna be sitting down right over here just relaxing. Oh, yeah! I thought you wanted a son. I wonder if he would have been able to make your lawnmower do that. Well, um, uh, oh, it's time to pay my bills. I hate being a grown-up. There's only like $10 in my bank account. Hey, Dad, um, check your bank account again. I made a few adjustments to your 401k and your investments and, uh... Wait, what? Th 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 this can't be my bank account. We're, we're almost b b billions. But I thought you wanted a son. Nope, nope. Daughters are great. Yay! You must have got your smarts from me. <laughs> your mom could never do this. Daddy, daddy, daddy. I pulled my pants. Yeah. Daddy, I need a diaper change. Oh, two diapers at once. No. Don't worry, dad. I've got this handled. Oh, Rosie. I am Rosie. Wow. What the heck is this? Um, Dad, I think it's a robot. Where did it come from? I built it. What? I clean your house, change the diapers, I do all the chores. Daisy, you built this? Are you serious? Yeah, but I thought you wanted a son. Change my diaper, change my diaper, Rosie Bot. You have a very smelly butt. I'll change you first. Oh my god! I'm so happy I have a daughter! Dad, you have two daughters! Ow! Okay, yeah, you and your amazing sister! Uh -oh. Looks like you're on the outs, Smiley. I knew having a baby sister was gonna be a bad idea! My sister. Womp, 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 womp. 346 minutes later. Oh, I'm here. That seemed to take forever. Brookie, hi. Hey, guys. I can't believe we got in a different bus coming here, but I'm so glad that we're finally all together. I know. Wait, Brookie, where are you going? Where are you going? I'm going over to say hi to Daisy. Don't worry about Daisy. She's just my annoying sister. Molly, rude. Brookie's both of our friends. Everybody look around. I want you to see where your tents are, where you'll be sleeping, and also where you'll be going potty for the rest of the summer. We're not going potty where we're sleeping? Well, you don't want to pee in your sleeping bag. Yeah. That's not what I meant. I meant inside the cabin. Uh, no, Molly. Duh. They have outhouses here. See the sign? Outhouse? What's, what's that mean? It means you have to go to the bathroom in this smelly outside bathroom. 
Wait, what? That's right, Molly. Go take a peek. Oh, my God. I have to go to the bathroom at an outhouse? I don't know about this summer camp thing. Okay, is this it? This can't possibly be the bathrooms, right? No, Molly. That's way too nice for the outhouse. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Ew! What's that horrible smell? Oh, I'm gonna throw up! You found it, Molly! Yeah. Oh, what is this? Oh, wait, is there even a toilet in here? Is it just like a hole in the ground? Oh, this place is disgusting! Let me out of here! I'm gonna barf! Well, Molly, just don't eat, it, eat any s'mores for the next week. And you won't have to worry about going to the bathroom. I still have to go to the bathroom, Daisy. What? Someone has fireworks? That's amazing. That's right. Everybody gather around for our awesome fireworks show. Okay, the outhouse is gross, but look at the fireworks show. Amazing. <laughs> ready for the day. Ew, a boy's in our cabin! No boys allowed! Ew! Yeah, boys totally have germs. Get out! Huh, what, what? Wow, even that didn't wake up, Molly. There was a boy in the girl's cabin! Well, well, well. Look who we have here. What? Sarah? What are you doing here? You're a bully! You shouldn't be at summer camp! <laughs> I'm just here to make your summer miserable! Now, that's a given! If you're here, everything's gonna be miserable! Molly, try to be nice! Why? She's never nice to me! That's true. I never am. Just looking at your face makes me want to vomit. Blah, 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 blah. Now, how do I get to the food tent? Must be this way. Five hours later. I'm so hungry. How much farther is the walk to the food tent? I need a breakfast burrito. I need a breakfast pizza. At this point, I'd eat anything. I'm starving. Ow. I think I'm off the trail, but, but... I smell something delicious, so it must be this way. Oh, look, there's a sign. Maybe it says it's the food tent. Always watches? No eyes? That's creepy. Hey, Brookie, Daisy, what do you think of this sign? Brookie? Daisy? Oh, man, I must have lost them. Whoa. Look at this. It's, it's a, a cave. Whoa. I've never been in a cave before. This is awesome. Wait a minute. Which way did I come in at? Oh, no. I think I'm lost. Holy guacamole! Th that's not a good sign. Oh! Okay, I've got to find my way out of here. Don't panic, Molly. D -d -d Don't panic. Panicking! Oh, my God. It's really dark in here now. What's happening? Ah! 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 What was that? I felt something on my face. Wait a minute. I have a lantern. Duh. <laughs> It was probably nothing. It was probably just like a part of a tree or... Yeah, that's it. I'm sure. And that skeleton is probably just a fake one. Someone put that there to prank everybody. Very funny. What's that? I don't know, but I want to go this way. Why can't I find my way out of here? Look! A camp counselor! They've come to rescue me! Over here! <laughs> <laughs> no! Stay back! Stay back, you evil monster! Ghost or whatever you are! Stay back! <laughs> You're mine! <laughs> now 
Really? Creepy! <gasps> what do you think Molly is? She ran off to the food tent, but then she never even showed up at the food tent. Now it's pouring down rain outside, and, and she hasn't even had breakfast. I don't know, maybe she went off exploring by herself. Or maybe she got lost because she's too stupid to find her way. Hey, that's not nice, Sarah. Well, I'm not saying it's nice to call Molly stupid or anything, but she does get lost a lot, even on her own street back home. Well, yeah, you have a point, but I'm just worried about her. I mean, what should we do? Goodbye and good riddance if you ask me. Goodbye and good riddance to who? Mommy, there you are. We've been so worried about you. Where have you been? Oh, um, I just decided to go for a hike, you know. <laughs> Get some healthy exercise in. Uh-huh, you exercise? That sounds a little weird. Yeah, Molly, and it's pouring down rain outside. I know, but I don't mind walking in the rain. Besides, I have an umbrella. I came prepared. Who are you and what have you done with my sister? What are you talking about? OMG, I can't believe I'm in summer camp with you guys. Here, eat all of my s'mores. I just love you guys. <laughs> I have a cheer I made up for you guys. Go, Star Squad. Go, Star Squad, go. Oh, I kind of messed it up. OMG, I'm just so nervous. Oh, it's a fan at summer camp with us. Go away. You're annoying. Whoa. I'm not even like that rude. You're always rude. And you're ugly, too. Ow. Molly. What has gotten into you? Did you fall off a cliff? I mean, seriously, did you bonk your head? <laughs> yeah, you're just kidding, right? Can I be a video in a video, please? I wouldn't have you in a video if you were the last person on YouTube. Whoa, she's rude. Maybe we shouldn't be her fan anymore. No, I'm sure my sister has a concussion. D don't, don't, don't believe anything she says. OMG, I'm still so happy. I've been watching you since I was four. Baby. Yeah. Cookie, do you notice something really strange about Molly? Yeah, she's sometimes really funny and farts too much, but she's never rude, especially to Star Squad fans. Something is really strange to you. Hey, you guys want a s'more? Molly doesn't want one. I don't think she likes me. <laughs> I know I look happy, but I'm really not. I'm actually crying inside my soul. Why doesn't Molly like me? Let me count the reasons. I'll sing them to you, actually. One, you're annoying. Two, you're kind of ugly. Three, you're also annoying. Three, stop this right now. Hi, um, okay, I'm just gonna go and, like, cry for the rest of my life. Okay, sounds good to me. Hey, I think you have great guitar skills. You would. What do you even know about guitar? Okay, all the fans need to get out. We need to figure out what's going on with Molly before she destroys our YouTube and our summer camp. Molly, what has gotten into you? Ooh, fire! <laughs> I love fire. Um, does anyone else notice that Molly's in the fire? Molly, you're gonna catch on! Oh my god, Molly! <gasps> she respawned. How was that even possible? Because that's not my sister. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> fire! Fire! <laughs> Who are you? I am the ghost. <laughs> oh, hi! My name is Daisy, just like the flower. I didn't ask your name, you little ugly brat! Molly, I know you're in there somewhere! You would never say something so rude to me! What? Of course I will! <laughs> You are annoying, and I don't want you as my sister anymore. Wait a minute. I think Molly is still trying to show through. Look, I can see a little bit of Molly's face. Molly, come back to us. <laughs> There's no Molly here. Guys, help me. I'm trapped inside. <sighs> More like I'm trapped.
trapped inside you, Molly. Ha ha ha. And I can make you do anything. Like go in the fire. Ah! Stop! I'm on fire! Guys, please help me become unpossessed! My summer camp's ruined! And you were talking rude to the Star Squad fans. Cheap was Molly. I'll never let you go, Molly. I know how to fix this. Molly, can you smell this delicious cheeseburger? Or this delicious s'more? Molly, fight, fight the ghost. Come on back to us. I don't think so. What's that smell? It's a delicious <laughs> s'more. You know you want it, Molly. Fight the demon. Yeah, Molly, you can eat this cheeseburger even if I did take a bite or two. I, I, I. Cheeseburgers and the s'mores. No. Goodbye, demon, but you cannot ever overcome the power of delicious food. I want it all. Give me it all. Mmm. This cheeseburger, though. Delicious. Molly, have some more too. So that so that the demon can't possess you ever again. I'm not sure that's how it works. If it means eating s'mores, <laughs> I'll definitely try it. Mmm. So good. Where's the burritos? Sorry, Molly, we don't have burritos. What? Okay, that's it. The demon's back. Oh no! Have my buddy run! Just kidding, it was me, but um, word is out about the burritos. Molly, I think you really have to say you're sorry to all the Star Squad fans. What? Why? You said some pretty harsh things to them while you were possessed by, with that old camper girl who died here. Wait, what? She died here? Yeah, it was pretty tragic. <laughs> She was hiking up that giant mountain and fell, and that was the end of her. Holy macaroni and cheese. Well, I'm sorry, fellow campers. And I'm sorry, fellow Star Squad fans. I I didn't mean to be rude. I was possessed. Mm. But I'm not now. And I'm definitely eating some s'more. Holy guacamole! These Star Squad fans be crazy. <laughs> well, camp started off a little bit rough. You know, I did get possessed by a dead girl. But it's starting to look up. At least I think it is. So, Molly, are you telling the truth? Yeah, I am. Isn't that crazy? But don't tell anybody, okay? Molly, your secret is safe with me. Ah, oh, good. <laughs> Not even my sister or anybody knows about this. Wow, just me? Yep. Oh, I gotta go. My sister Daisy's here. What are you keeping secrets about, Molly? Um, nothing. Nothing. You and Bookie Cookie have a secret, and you're not telling me. That's not nice, Molly. Well, it's just between her and I, okay? And it's not really a secret or anything, so don't worry about it. Just forget about it. Okay, Molly, but I don't think you're telling the truth. I am, Daisy. I am. Uh -huh, sure, Molly. Oh, that was a close one. I can't let my sister know what's going on. Okay. I'm just going to go out here and check on things. Make ev sure everything's okay. What is Molly up to? I'm going to follow her into the backyard. Is my sister following me right now? She is! Daisy, what do you want? Molly, you're hiding something. And I want to know what it is right now. Daisy, I'm not hiding anything. I swear, I'm just going for a walk. You're going for a walk in the backyard. Yeah, we have a big backyard. Yeah, not that big, Molly. What do you think? It's like an Olympic stadium or something? <laughs> no, but look at all the woods we have. I like walking through the trees and... Liar, Molly! You're lazy. You don't go for walks. That's not true. If there's a cupcake on the walk, I'll go. Oh, brother. Girls, do you want a snack? I can make you something. I'm getting a snack. Bye, Daisy. Molly, this isn't over. You have to tell me what you're hiding. Nope, not going to do it. Nope, nope, nope. Mom, will you make us a snack? Of course I will. What were you thinking you wanted? Um, Can we have something delicious and like a treat? Mm, yeah, you girls ate really healthy today. I guess you can have a treat. I'm ready for it, Mom. So, Molly, are you going to tell me what this little secret is? 
What secret? What are you girls talking about? There's no secret! Daisy, shh. Oh, you don't want mom to know the secret. Um, if there was a secret to tell, then everyone could know what it is. But there's no secret! There's a secret. And I'm gonna find out what it is. So anyway, mom, what are you making us? Something really delicious. Okay, let's see. There's flour, milk, and a cupcake pan. <gasps> Mom, are you making me cupcakes? <laughs> Maybe. Oh, you're the best mom ever. I love you, Mom. I seriously love you, love you, love you. Okay, girls, here's your delicious cupcakes. I don't have any frosting, sorry. That's okay, Mom. Who needs frosting? Hmm. These are delicious. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Yum. Cheap was Marty you gonna save some cupcakes for the best of us? Uh-huh, sure. Mm. So good. Uh Molly, take your time. You're gonna get a stomach ache. Um, I'm gonna eat this last cupcake in the backyard. See you guys later. <laughs> what? Why does she wanna eat it outside? I don't know. Maybe she just wants some fresh air, Daisy. Everybody needs fresh air sometimes. Oh, okay, I've gotta save this. Um, you know, I wanna make sure she has enough to eat. Molly, what on earth are you doing? <laughs> Daisy, what are you Why are you following me? Molly, you better tell me what this secret is right now. Okay, fine, but you can't tell anybody. Do you promise? I promise, Molly. What is it? Daisy, why are you swimming so weird? I don't know. I'm just kind of stuck in the water. <laughs> you look really weird right now. Oh, because you're an expert swimmer. Um, okay, see you later, Daisy. Molly, you just tried to distract me. Tell me what this secret is, please, Molly. Please, please, please. Okay, I found a baby mermaid. What? No, you didn't. You are a liar. That's not true. It's true. I was on my way home from school one day, and you know how you just walk past that one part of the river? Yeah. Well, there was a baby mermaid in there. What? Yep, it's totally true. And she needed my help. So I brought her home, and I made her a nursery in our pool. I don't believe you, Molly. If you don't believe me, just follow me. Where are you going? Swim down. Swim down, Daisy. Molly, why are you swimming through the filter of the pool? Whoa, what is this place? I told you. I made a nursery for my baby mermaid. Molly, I don't know what's going on right now. This nursery is adorable, but I don't see a baby mermaid. Okay, they don't play that, papa. What? There's a baby mermaid! <laughs> I told you there was a baby mermaid! Oh my god, she's beautiful. Thank you, I think she's adorable too. Oh, beautiful mermaid. So now you know why you gotta keep this baby mermaid a secret. Like, I'm pretty sure everyone would freak out if they knew there was a baby mermaid in town. Everyone would want to adopt her. No! I don't want everyone to adopt her. I want her to be a part of our family. I get to do what I tell ya. I get cocky, Papa. Wow, Molly. What's her name? Her name's Baby Kira. Wow, she's adorable. Thank you. And also, I just can't believe it. I can't believe I found a baby mermaid. This just doesn't happen every day. No, Molly, it really doesn't. Give me a tour around the nursery. And this is her little crib. And her cute little pictures are above. There's a little chair that I can sit and rock her in if she needs that before she goes to sleep. Here's her changing table with her changing pad and there's a box of diapers and wipes. Here's her little closet where she can get dressed. She has so cute, some really cute outfits like, well, basically just tops because her bottoms, you know, she's got a tail. So um, she can't wear like pants or anything. And then over here is a dresser where I just keep like extra toys and stuff. Wow, Molly, this is adorable. I love the pictures and the paintings and the walls. She even has a pet octopus doll. That's adorable. Yeah, I think so, too. <laughs> um, So, yeah, this is basically her room. But, Molly, you can't keep her. What do you mean I can't keep her? Why not? Because, Molly, she has to go back in the ocean where she belongs. What? No! She's my baby mermaid. I found her, and, and I love her. She's like my sister. Molly, you can't keep her. Besides, Mom will find out. No, she won't. Nope, I'm going to keep her down here until she's 18. No one will ever know. Molly, you can't do that. Girls, where are you? Oh, baby Kira, my sweet little mermaid baby. You stay down here, okay? 
Um, and I'll bring you a bottle soon, okay? I'll be right back. Coming, Mom! Mom, we're coming! Now don't breathe a word of this to Mom! Okay, Molly. Don't tell me what. Are you girls keeping a secret? No, we don't have any kind of secret. Why would we be doing that? I mean, we were just in the pool because we wanted to go for a swim, not because we have a secret. Daisy! Wait, is the secret in the pool? Who said anything about a secret? I don't have a secret. There's not a secret under the pool. Daisy! Ugh, my sister's terrible at keeping secrets. Okay, time to see what's underneath the pool. Nothing! Nothing! Don't go in the pool, Mom! There might be a sea monster in there. Molly, don't be ridiculous. Ah, this water's cold. Mom, don't go down there! Molly! Oh, great, Daisy. You spilled the beans! Well, not technically. What is going on down here? Um, nothing, Mom. Nothing at all. Oh, my gosh. Is that a baby mermaid? Um, nope. You're just seeing things. Molly, how long have you had this baby mermaid? Um, like a week. And you set up this nursery for her? Yeah, I, I didn't want her to be alone. Oh, Molly, that's so nice of you. Maybe we could adopt her. Really? She, she doesn't have to leave? Well, it's up, to, it's up to the baby mermaid. What's her name? Her name's baby Kira. Little mermaid, do you want to go back to the ocean? I don't know. No mommy, no daddy. Oh my gosh, she has no mom and dad. Well, we'll be her mom and dad. Okay, baby, I've got to go pick up some milk and diapers. No, mom, I did all that. I I've got it all. Come on, I'll show you. Molly, what happened? I was too afraid to go down there. I thought you were going to be grounded forever. No, mom says we can adopt the baby mermaid. Really? Yes, girls, but you're not allowed to keep secrets from me, okay? Okay, mom, I promise, no more secrets. What? When she gets out of the water, she has legs! What? Are you kidding me? No! She turns into a human, Mom! Um, that's unexpected. What's she doing? I don't know. What are you doing? Oh my gosh, the baby mermaid turned into a little human baby, and now she's eating watermelon out of the refrigerator. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Well, welcome to the family, baby mermaid. <laughs>